here with this Dave Dugdale learning DSLRVD.com. Down in my basement, a little studio action going on here. I'm just going to demonstrate on how I set up exposure for the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera. All right, so right here we got a 800 ASA or ISO, a little confusing. Uh, white balance got 5600K. Uh, well, it got some fluorescent lights, so it's going to be a little bit of a green tint. And shutter angle, we've got uh, 172.8. So if I go down to here under recording settings and I go up, uh, I am set not to film, but to video on how I set the exposure. And then if I go down, you'll notice that I'm displaying video. All right, so if we get out of here, and right now you can see I've got focus peaking on. At least you probably see some green lines there. If I, let's say if I, let's wildly change the exposure. Let's say if I go down to like, f3.7 and I zoom in a little bit here and if I hit the iris button once boom it shows that I've got an 8.7 okay and that's good because and you guys are going to probably laugh at me on this one but with my new iPhone I've got this um, app with the Luxie this is called the Luxie. It was kind of expensive for a little piece of plastic, but it turns it into a, a fairly accurate light meter. So I've got my ISO at 800, 50 of a second, and we're gonna go meter in front here where the light's hitting. I'll try not to block the light, about where I'm standing. And sure enough, look at that, it says F9. So it's saying that I've got F9. So what I'm gonna do real quick is I'm gonna hit uh, record here on the pocket camera. Snap a couple times so I can sync that up. And I'm gonna go ahead and stand right here. And you're gonna notice it's kind of dark. Again, we're in video mode right now, filming. So what I'm gonna do now is put this back about where I had it. And I'm gonna hit stop. And then we're gonna to go to menu and change this to film or it should say log I guess and now what I'm going to do now is when I hit the iris button once watch what happens boom it says oh you need to be at 8 or 2.8 and well to be a little bit fair let's zoom in like I did last time and hit the iris button still 2.8 so it's saying when you hit the iris button it automatically exposes so if I go ahead and stand in front of here uh, you're going to see I'm way overexposed. Let me uh, hit record. Uh, you're going to notice that I'm way overexposed. All right. So, so what do you do? So, I'm going to hit stop. And what I'm going to do is I know from experience that in film mode, if I go to about 6.7, that's usually around 40, 45% on my waveform monitor. So I'm gonna hit record. So right now, if I look at this gray on the waveform monitor, it's going to be around 45, almost 50%. Usually with my 5D Mark III, I'll take the 18% the gray and make it 50% on the um, waveform monitor and it's really accurate. But in this case, I'm around 45%. It's not quite exposed right. So what we're gonna do is go back, sit stop here, and I'm gonna change this to the 8.7. Let's hit record. It looks dark on the screen, but when I come here, and it's probably gonna be more like in the 30 IRE range when I record. So that's pretty much it. So basically what I do, and to recap, and I've had this camera for about a month and I've been very frustrated with it in terms of how to set exposure. Um, so what you do is you go to video mode, hit the iris button, which should get you kind of close, but if you wanna do it really uh, accurate, like you're in a studio situation, use like a gray card, um, or a light meter, um, set it for video, and then go into film, and then put in the or keep the aperture where it was. But it'll probably lose it. A lot, a lot of times with these, 
this camera, if you go from video mode to still mode, or you turn the camera off, you turn it back on, it loses all its settings and you have to replug them in. So that's pretty much it. Uh, hope that helps somebody. Um, it, this camera is really cool. I'm gonna be doing a review on it pretty soon, but I thought I'd just put this out there. Um, if I'm doing this wrong, cause you know, I'm, <laughs> this is a brand new camera. I have no idea what I'm doing with it. So uh, if you know a better way to expose for uh, with this camera accurately, definitely let me know. All right, talk to you guys later. Bye.